So how can you sync your data from the Apple Watch to the iPad? And let's get started and let's explain that. So at first, what you need to make sure is that your iPad and the iPhone have and use the very same Apple ID account. So you can check it out by opening up the settings. And as you can see at the top, you have like a name and like your profile picture. So you can see all of the iCloud and all of the other data listed there. And you want to make sure that the same account is using a, is being used across your iPad and iPhone. This is going to ensure that the data gets synced. And then what you need to do is to just wear the Apple Watch and the data, like the health related data, your steps, sleep, and all of the recorded stuff will be shared across your devices. One thing to check out, of course, is on your iPad. When you go to your settings and tap on your name at the top right there and go to iCloud apps, you want to ensure that the health synchronization is enabled, meaning that the data from the uh, Apple Watch will be synced to the cloud and also appear on the iPad, right? So that's how you can go ahead and just like share the data right there, you know, make kind of everything connected. Same thing with, for example, the voice memos. If you record a voice memo, you have it automatically synced to your iPhone. And if you have it turned on for iCloud, well, it will also appear on the iPad. So that's how you can connect it. Same thing with messages and even some other apps which work over the internet. So the main conditions are to have the same Apple ID and then making sure that iCloud synchronization is enabled for these various different services and apps so it just makes sure that you know you are on the same page with all of the data across all of your devices so that's it let me know below in the comments if you managed to successfully set it up and basically that's gonna be about it subscribe and i'll see you later in the next videos